Yep, just a jink. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel if it's your first time here or if you subscribe to my channel while I was away welcome I officially welcome you to my channel if you're a returning subscriber welcome back my G oh my god I almost forgot how that good feels my name is Anora Mwaba Mwanga like she's singer I am a mental health advocate apart from that I create content based on my inheritance and lifestyle yay so yeah <laughs> i was away i'm not gonna explain why i was away i'm not gonna give a life update the only update that i'm gonna give is that i graduated officially uh the reason being why i'm not gonna update anything i'm not gonna give a life update is because um me being away was kind of me being uh on a life vacation and uh, we're currently going through uh is it self in self instrument <laughs> Yes, self introspection otherwise it's good to be back so I thought I'm like okay you know what? instead of us getting uh, getting back into the serious things that we usually do let's start off with um, truth or drink yeah truth or drink <laughs> session so this video is inspired by Lulu she did something on her channel I'm gonna leave the link to the video down in the description below I have a low tolerance for alcohol so for this one we're gonna be using vinegar not alcohol so yeah we're using vinegar so to any questions that I fail to answer I am taking vinegar white vinegar it's bitter yo and it burns so here's the first question what's your most shallow reason for not going back on a second date <laughs> well uh, I don't like the way I was looked at I don't know if that's a shallow reason. I don't like the way somebody looked at me or somehow the way somebody talked to me or something like that. Yeah, I think that's one of the most shallow reasons why I have never gone back on a second date with somebody. What's the worst date you've ever been on? Well, I went out on a date with somebody and they probably know themselves. If you're watching this video, you probably know who you are. Um, and the whole entire time that we were out, the person was on their phone. I know I do this sometimes for people, but the person was on their phone the whole entire and it was so irritating. I'm like, yo, I thought we were out here to bond and not you being here to press your phone, guys. I'm quite me. If I ever if that ever happens to me again, I'm just leaving. Name something illegal that you have done and regret. Guys, my aunt, my mom, and any other older people that I respect watch these videos. So definitely, we're taking the vinegar. I don't know if this is enough. <laughs> Get this. Bends. It bends. <laughs> it bends. Have you ever dated someone secretly? Yes. Yes, I have. What's your dream first date? Okay, I've, I've been on a date before, but I think my dream date is, in my get to know me tag, I even mentioned this, my dream date is um, being taken out on a picnic date, like late night date under the moon with the matendos, the shahani. I don't know, I, for some reason I feel like Zambian men are no longer romantic. <laughs> Correct me if I'm wrong, or maybe I just keep on meeting the wrong ones. Have you ever cheated or been the other woman and you knew it? And I, oh! I'm even ashamed when it comes to answering this question. Yes, I have cheated before, and yes, <laughs> I have been the other woman. Oh my god! Yeah, I'm, I'm embarrassed to answer this question. I'm not very proud. What is the biggest secret you have kept from your parents when you were growing up? Uh, so I told my mom this sometime last year, she was hurt, 
and I don't think it's something that I'm yet the skeleton that I'm ready to let out of the closet so let it burn <coughs> do you have a bucket list yes I do if so what is the what is one thing that's on the bucket on that list um bungee jumping yeah like I've always wanted to go bungee jumping or mountain climbing so yeah those are one of the things I mentioned too actually um what is the best pickup line you've ever hit so my crash I was texting my crash I think sometime earlier this year I don't think he knows it's my crash and it was we were joking about how he's got a big nose I, I, I was telling him he's got a big nose and he finishes the air and then he said something about like um yeah that's how he managed to you know he managed to finish the air and um and and what sweep me off my feet i don't know catch my breath that's how he managed to catch my breath and sweep me off my feet and i had he had me falling talented brilliant incredible amazing show-stopping spectacular never the same totally unique <laughs> guys i don't know i don't know if you guys but you guys this, this pick up line is dry but for me it was like yeah and the fact that it came from my crash anyways <sighs> we move the number of serious relationships you have been in three the most petty reason someone broke up with you guys i think it's because i'm churchy i'm too no no not not because i'm too churchy there's this one one time when i was going to when i was in my first year when i was going to school my gap year boyfriend apparently he told me that he couldn't continue with me because um, I was going to school and I'm too beautiful and where I'm going there guys and he didn't trust me and I'm like dude we've been dating for a year plus and you still don't trust me till now I was touched and I was touched to this day I'm still touched I'm still touched about it I'm also touched about me being churchy <sighs> anyways why not just tell me the whole the reason why you're breaking up with me and what that anyways I'm not gonna be dramatic um, so I mentioned something about where, where the question where it was like have you ever been cheated on or have you ever been the second have you ever been the other woman and you knew it if you want to hear story time on those two things two scenarios please leave a comment down in the comment section below so that I can tell you guys how it was my experience and the like yeah so thank you for having me back and thank you for watching I hope this video was interesting yes and definitely a scene more of me bye